employed. Unemployed. Sort of. Unemployed. There's an alternative to employment or unemployment. It's self-employment. Giving yourself a job. Making a job for yourself and maybe others too. Creating enterprise and a business you can call your own. There are some advantages to being self-employed such as having more control over your work, your hours. And at midnight, here is the news. And your place of work. There are also some disadvantages, such as the insecurity of an irregular income, or possibly no income at all. The isolation of working by yourself. And the fact that everything you need, you'll have to provide. A bit different from being employed. Not everyone is cut out to be self-employed. You can't blame the boss for making a wrong decision. It's your fault! You are the boss. You can't overspend on expenses. It's your money you're spending. You can't expect to be paid for time off, holidays or illness. Who's going to pay you? More important, perhaps, is that if you neglect your business, your business may die. It will need constant care and attention from the one and only person who stands to gain or lose the most, you. So, do you have what it takes? Of course, you'll need a good business idea. One that will attract continuous customers prepared to pay you enough money to make at least a reasonable living. But you'll need a lot more than that. Thank you. You'll need the ability to sell yourself in addition to your product or service. Um. If you don't believe in yourself, no one will buy from you. <clears throat> no, thank you. And if you don't believe in your product or service, no one will buy that either. No, thank you. You'll certainly need to be good with money. Anyone can sell a product or service cheaply. But could you sell yours for a profit? <laughs> Ah, yeah, yes. OK, right. So, oh, so, sorry. Yep. You'll need to be able to cope when you're busy. Ah, oh, this is the one. And when you're not. You'll need to be prepared to do things you'll never be paid for, such as your bookkeeping. Oh, that's no selling, problem. I do all sorts of colours and sizes. And letter writing. Oh. You'll need to be tough to deal with all of business's problems. Determined to see them through to the end. Friendly to keep your customers and suppliers happy. Flexible to cope with changing circumstances that affect all businesses. You'll also need the support of your family. Yeah? Will they help you in the right way? What? I'm phoning about your flexible service. He's tied up at the moment. Most of all, perhaps, you'll need vision. The vision to see how your business might develop, prosper and grow. And you'll need to acquire the right skills, support and attitude to help make your vision come true. In this country, everyone has the right to give themselves a job, to become self-employed, to start their own business, to create enterprise. It could be the most exciting, risky, adventurous and dangerous decision you'll ever have to make. And the decision is all yours.